Hey guys, I just wanted to do a quick vlog on um, fashion for the fall, some more little fashion tips, and I wanted to bring up some ideas that uh, people may not think of, ideas in terms of places and what kind of products I like or use. I'm always getting questions on where do you buy your makeup, what do you wear, or did you get that cute shirt? And I'm like, Walmart? And they're like, uh, what? And I'm like, seriously, Walmart, Target, Cato, Old Navy has some great stuff. So um, keep in mind that places that we would normally turn our nose up to or not even think of have really cute items for fall. Things that might be stuff that we wouldn't normally want to spend 45, 50 bucks on, we can get for 14 or 15. And a lot of times with fall fashions, we're looking at stuff with fringe that you know, may not be in next year or a certain style may not be in next year. So when you're throwing out 40, 50 bucks on an item, you're going to wear it a few years in a row. Well, you know, maybe you don't want to wear it again next year. So you find it at Walmart for 15 bucks. I usually wear stuff regardless, but some people like to go through their clothes every year and get rid of stuff and buy new. So when you're shopping on a budget, you can do that if you if you find them for cheap deals. So, um, I mean, cheap prices, not cheap deals. I'm so tired right now. I had to take an allergy pill because my head is pounding. So anyway, um, uh, check out the vlog and let me know what you think and tell me where you get some of your deals and bargains, okay? All right, bye-bye. I don't spend a lot on makeup, but there are certain things that I do need um, that are good and that they're not costly, but I'll, I'll splurge on a couple of like basic foundation items. I don't wear foundation, I refuse. Um, I don't like it. It's always been very oily on my skin and I don't feel like I've ever had a proper match. And I used to use prescriptives years ago and they got rid of prescriptives. So when prescriptives was gone, I went and I searched all the, the cosmetic counter lines and I thought, well, let me try Lancome, let me try Estee Lauder. Well, those just, nothing worked like prescriptives. So I went over to Mac and they took out their book and they, they were ready for people from prescriptives. They matched me really well and I love Mac. I'm not getting paid to do this, I just love it. This is about, um, Oh goodness, this go up in price. I think these are like $26. It's the um, Studio Fix Cosmetic, uh, it's like a powder, Studio Fix. And this is a C3, I wear C3 year round. In the summer sometimes I wear C4, but I'm trying not to let my skin you know, get as tan because I get uh, dark spots. So I've been wearing the C3 pretty much year round. I also splurge on the um, MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. Love it. It's a fantastic cover-up, so if you're looking for a really good cover-up, you can go get this. What I like about it is they're going to match you in the store. Yes, it's going to be about, I think it's $23. I could be wrong on my prices, though, so don't hold me to it. It's going to be a little more costly, but if you just use these two items, they're going to last you anywhere. How much you wear makeup from, this will usually last me like three to four months. And um, this one will usually last... Oh, my mom picked this up for me last time. I wonder how, I can't remember how long this lasts, but this lasts say four to six months on this. I mean, depending on how you use it. I just use it on my circles and any kind of um, little blemish I might have or a spot. Anyway, so if you add that up, you're looking at, yeah, a little bit more than Maybelline or L'Oreal, but they're matching you when you go in the store. And I like about MAC is they're like a free-spirited makeup company. Their stuff is cheaper because they don't spend a lot on product. What does it matter? You don't need a flashy powder case. So what I do love is, um, I don't buy their lipstick, but I'm going to tell you. What they do is awesome. If you bring in six, save up six of your concealers or your powders or whatnot, six empty items, they'll give you a freebie. So today I get to go and get my freebie. So um, the last time I got a freebie, it was my New York Apple lipstick. They give you two choices. I think they give you two lipstick choices. I think sometimes they change it up, but I've only ever gotten a free lipstick. This is my spare. I keep it in the car just when I forget like my makeup bag at home and at least I have lips. Um, sometimes in Texas it'll melt, so I try to be careful with time of year, but it's always nice to have an extra lipstick and it's a nice color. The other color I think is probably more for um, not as the rosy colors. This one is really, really pretty. It looks pretty on me too. I'm wearing it right now. So, if you're looking for a good cosmetic, a good cover, 
go with Mac. I said, like I said, they're fantastic. And I love the people that work for Mac. They're all like crazy people. They like have wild hair and they're just fun. So, and then you get a freebie too. I mean, I save my little bag and I keep it under my counter. And when I get an empty, I throw it in there. And this morning I thought, oh, I think I have six. Four powders and um, two concealer packages to turn in. So that's what they do. It's totally awesome. I mean, you get like a little freebie. And um, they've got some good eye stuff too. I, I did buy a palette a while back and their palettes last forever. But I usually don't splurge on, on makeup. I usually just get, like I said, the foundation basics. I'll be back and show y'all what I get for free. Okay, I'm back and with my new lipstick on. Hmm, I'm liking it. It's not really a color I would go for, but I figured it was free, so what the hell. It's called Rebel. Every silver topped uh, lipstick is the freebies, and there's quite a few choices. I stood there for like 10 minutes, like, I don't know which one I like them all. So, um, anyway, keep that in mind. If you're looking for a nice coverage, makeup that's not too expensive but it's you know it'll last you go with mac i really enjoy their stuff okay. look at this precious outfit i'm at kato fashion if you have kato go run to the kato i brought connie with me but she won't be on camera she's talking to herself this shirt's fun it's one of those high lows to do live in the here and now go with the flow and be happy Oh, Connie's singing. Connie. Slightly Connie. lower Connie. front Connie. rise with fuller coverage back. Thank you. And you know which one? Tell them it's the one See, that I like that. I like that their labels the yeah. tell you what they have so you can go look before you waste all your time in the fitting room. Say, look, classic, modern. Look at that. See? God, I love Kato. This is uh, this is my new Walmart find for fourteen ninety nine. I'm doing my vlog, by the way. I'm not talking to myself. Are oh, you doing your vlog? Well, I'm just showing them my sweater. Okay. Is this not precious? It's faded glory. Okay, so I'm at Walmart. Look at look how cute these are. Fringe is in. Eight eighteen ninety four. Fringe. That's cute. And then I'm wearing mine that I showed y'all earlier. Mine was fourteen ninety nine. Wonder where that one is. It's, it's mixed in this big pile of crap over here. Yeah, yeah. See? Look, you can't shop this, Walmart. What is this? You can't. This is too tight. It's on that side, I think. Oh. There it is, right there. Where? I'm not allowed to put Connie on camera. Whoop. Got her. Okay. Deal of the day. I got this at Kato. Now, look. It's that high-low kind of look that I, I just love it. Just a little bit though, not not a huge, tremendous, like short in the front, long in the back. I bought this in a larger size because I wanted it to hang longer and kind of baggy. But $21.99 at Kato. I think this is precious. And it's got pink in it. Pink is in. I'm seeing a ton of pink and the black. Oh, I love it. That's one of my favorite colors. $3.99 on clearance. I know, my husband's probably like, you don't need any more jewelry. Okay, guys, look at this. 99 cents for the earrings and necklace. Shut up, right? Not joking. I'm not kidding around. Look, we even asked the gal, Charity, at the uh, Kato in uh, Tyler, the one-off troop. What a precious gal. Loved her customer service, Kato. You have a good employee there. Anyway, um, we asked her if that was correct because originally it's $14.99, and then it was marked to $6.99, and then 99 cents. Shut up. Connie made me buy it so she could borrow it. She's so cheap. She didn't buy it herself. Just kidding, Connie. I love you. Anyway, if you have a Kato, check it out. The fabulous deals in there and the clothing fits you like really well it fits a woman's body it ain't no skanky cut slim little girl outfit if it's a normal woman okay go check it out i can't wait to wear this I'm supposed to be getting cooler here next week thank god because again today i'm in capri pants and a short sleeve shirt i'm hot so go check out kato if you have one if you don't look online I mean, I'm, you cannot believe the tremendous deals that they have in this store and cute, cute stuff. And the thing about Kato is you have to go in and grab it while you can. And the good thing about Kato is it's pretty affordable. So this entire outfit, car, well, shirt, not an outfit, sorry. Shirt, bracelet, earrings, necklace, entire thing cost, um, let's see, $4, 5 $26. 